Sending your Citizen watch out for repair. Is it worth it and what should you expect from the experience? I'll cover that in today's video. Stay tuned. So you'll have to forgive me for the weird camera angle here. My tripod just broke and so I'm kind of working with this improvised mounting system here. Um, but I wanted to make sure I got this video done because I just got my Citizen watch back yesterday in the mail and I'll show you the unboxing. Brand new crystal. It's just a mineral crystal, but it's brand new now, so it looks fantastic. They've buffed out the scratches on the on the bracelet. Cleaned it really well. Buffed out some of the scratches and nicks around the around the bezel cleaned up the crown, cleaned up the entire thing. It looks fantastic. So there's my little Citizen Nighthawk back from repair. So there are two locations in the United States that I'm aware of uh, authorized to repair citizens wa citizen watches. Um, one is on the East Coast and it's called Hurley Roberts Service. Uh, and that's where I sent my citizen watch to be repaired. The process is very simple. You just go to HurleyRobertsService.com, uh, you register on the site, um, you uh, uh, provide your details, you provide information about your watch, the model number, uh, some details about what is wrong with the watch, uh, what you want them to repair, and you request a shipping label. And immediately you get a free shipping label um, that allows you to send your watch in with instructions for how to send your watch in and you send your watch in. Uh, a few days later, you'll get uh, an email saying that they received your watch, and maybe a day or two later, they'll send you an estimate for repairing your watch. And you have the option to either um, authorize the repair or not authorize repair. If you don't authorize the repair, they'll send the watch back to you. If you authorize the repair, you can pay for it online immediately, and then they repair your watch and send it back to you. Now the watch I sent in had some significant damage. Um, what I'll do is I'll probably put up a side-by-side -side, uh, or at least a you know a beginning shot to give you uh, a sense of uh, how damaged it was. So to finish out on the experience, if you go to the Hurley Roberts Service website, you'll see reviews and people remarking that their uh, watch repair only took a few weeks or maybe even a few days after they, after, after they you know, heard back from Hurley Roberts. Mine took a little bit longer, um, and I think that's because of the time of year I sent mine in. So be cognizant of that. I sent mine in right before the holidays, um, and that's always a bad time. You know, people are out. Uh, of course, you know, watch repair technicians and watchmakers take time off as well. Uh, so mine took, you know, a little bit longer than the estimate, uh, but I'm certainly happy with what I got back. In terms of is it worth it? Uh, the answer is, is of course yes, uh, but it's really up to you. Um, you know, is the is the watch uh, an important watch to you? Is it important in your collection? Uh, mine cost about one hundred and sixty dollars to re to to repair. Now the watch is only two hundred and forty dollars to begin with, but I like the watch a lot. And you know, for one hundred and sixty dollars, it was an easy enough uh, repair and, and your choice of repair. You know, because I really wanted to be able to wear it again. If the watch is a more expensive Citizen watch, of course it's worth, you know, the $200, $250 it's going to be to, re to, to, to fix it and repair it. Um, it's a $600, $700 Citizen watch. Uh, the answer is, of course, yes. You're going to wait a little while to get it fixed, uh, but it's worth it having, it having it back in your collection. So I hope you find this video helpful. If you do, please click like below and subscribe. Thank you.